former militant leaders from the United States of the Niger Delta region have called on President Muhammad Buhari on the need for the completion of the East-West Road project and an increase in the funding of the presidential amnesty program in order to sustain and encourage the security, the situation in the region. The, all the pocket violence that has been taking place in our riverine areas has been slain down because of the, the quick payment of the stipends. Most times we do advise our people to in the Niger Delta that anybody that has grievances should channel it to the right area. It's wrong for we to take laws into your hands. So we plead with Niger Deltans, we plead with those that are involved in the amnesty program to support Professor Charles Dokobo. The thing that is bothering us is the East West Road. We have said it two or three weeks ago when we met that Mr. President should help us and uh, work on the East-West Road because that East-West Road is really giving us uh, uh, is so much problem because, uh, as you can see, like a few days ago, we heard of accident, serious accident that happened along the East-West Road. So if they can uh, uh, key into action of uh, constructing that East-West Road properly, uh, we think uh, this uh, ugly situation that is on uh, will stop. We, the leaders, are saying that the new person whom Mr. President appointed is doing extremely well. We come to wonder why, basically because he's not a politician. That a this program is a security program that doesn't need to have any bridge on the way. So a bridge might bring back the bad old days that we do not pray for. Most of them have been trained, most have been empowered, and the empowerment process is still ongoing. That's how, we, that's how we always call Mr. President to release more funds to the office so that they can do more of these trainings and empowerment.